What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Tyler Rose back again with another video, man. If you like this video, at the end of the video, please hit subscribe. If you want to subscribe now, go ahead and hit subscribe, man. But we're gonna bring you some cool content for shoes and sneaker stuff. So let's go, man. Let's get started. Never gonna strike me, even if you did, they ain't never quite like me. That ain't like me, that ain't really like me. So today we're going to be discussing the Jordan 4 Union. I mean, just look at it, man. Just look at it. Ooh, that right there is a beautiful shoe, man. So for the Jordan 4 Union, there's a few things we want to get into, right? Number one, we're going to jump right into it. How to cop. So Union Jordan LA will have all the Union Jordans that will be dropping on August 29th. If you go into the site right now, you'll be able to see the clock they have, which is ticking down towards the 29th of August. So that's where the shoe will be available for. From what I see, if you're in the LA area, according to the Union's Instagram, they're having a raffle which already took place. So if you're from the LA area, you might even have a better chance of getting a shoe or might even get in two pairs. So if you already checked that out, if you did, comment below and tell me how the raffle went and tell me what the process was, that would be cool. So according to Sneaker Bar Detroit, while the Union Jordans are going to release exclusively on August 29th on the Union site, by September 30th, the Union Jordans, all the Jordans that they were releasing on the 29th, will be released everywhere globally on September 30th. So that's one thing to keep in mind. So if you did miss on the 29th on Union's uh, Jordan LA's official site, you will be able to get them again on the 30th via sneaker app. Um, I think there's gonna be other smaller stories that they'll probably release later on that will be getting the release. So definitely keep your eyes open for that. Now, if you wanna take a different route and you're too impatient and you need to shoot right, right now, go ahead and go on StockX or go and go look at these prices. Look at these prices. You're gonna be paying an arm and a leg for them. You might as well wait, stay patient, and, and test your luck on the Union site. And if not, wait till September 30th when they release globally and you have a better chance at getting a shoe. And if you're lucky enough to live in the LA area, you're getting three opportunities. You're getting the raffle from the Union store, you're getting a Union release on August 29th, and you're getting the September 30th release. So you got three opportunities, three opportunities to get the shoes. Versus me, I'm only gonna have two. So consider yourself lucky. And if you don't know who Union is, Union is basically an LA company that does streetwear, design, um, you know, it's kind of the high, a little bit of a high-end fashion. They do some cool designs and they've, they've worked with Jordan in the past. Now let's get into the resale value. So now as you know, Union did release a Jordan 1 in 2018. And if you look online, it's going from at least 1,500 to like 5,000. But if you look at the shoe, it's a great shoe. It was a really, really nice shoe. Um, so for this particular release for the Jordan 4, already they're, they're going for at least 1200 to 35 right now. Right now they're already, the lowest I've seen them is a 1200 so by the time they re officially release, um, I'm not sure how they're going to do. I don't know if they're going to be as popular as the Jordan 1. For some reason the Jordan 1 has been become really, really popular. When I first started, you know, getting into shoes when I was young, like, you know, 13, 12, 14 years old, like really, really young. I used to love collecting Jordan 1s, they were one of my favorite ones, but lately it became like a trend or something and the ones just started skyrocketing in prices. I remember getting the Boston Celtics and Chicago Bulls package and it was like $180 or something like that. And I could just get them at finish line or, or expressions. But nonetheless, back to the point. So for the Jordan 4 unions, um, my estimate is probably they'll shoot up to around $1,500 to $2,000 and that, that would be like the, the range they stay at. I did see one going for $34,000 oh. in size 14. Oh. He Bruh. needs some milk. Bruh. Come on. Um, so I don't think they'll be that high either, but that's something to keep in mind. Um, you know, if you're a reseller or you're just buying the shoe to wear, um, either way, um, I think they'll be profitable. They're, they're definitely going to be more profitable than a regular retro Jordan release. Let's face it, the Jordan, the regular retro they just released now, they only go for like about maybe 60 to $50 over retail now. They don't really have a lot of resale value compared to when Jordan collabs with like Off-White or Travis Scott um, shoe design or um, Union or you know, just something that's not just regular retro Jordan. Um, they always end up doing well and they always end up selling a lot more compared to the regular release shoes. And they are releasing the Air Jordan Zoom 92s and they're releasing the Jordan Deltas. However, I know you're watching this video because you came for them fours. You know it, you know it, you know it, you know it. And yeah, there you have it. So you know where to get the shoes, you know where to cop them. You know, all you need to do is have some luck. I hope y'all get them, I hope I get them. 
and thank you for watching. If you really liked my video and you enjoyed it, please hit subscribe and hit the bell and you'll be notified whenever I drop a new video. Thanks for watching. Be a born winner, man. We all the born winners, man. You know what time it is, man. I'm out of here, man. Peace.